So today we're going to talk about trash. We're going to talk about garbage, rubbish, basura, whatever you want to call it. It can be found in any city in Acapulco, Tambien. So every year we come here and we go through the tourist area and sometimes we see trash and we complain about it. We can't believe, we say, why are the locals continuing to make this area dirty when they know the tourists are going to come by here? We complain, we visit, we complain, we visit. And then this year I thought, why, why are we complaining about this? Why aren't we trying to do something? I know we're just tourists, but what the heck, let's give it a shot. So I called my friends in New York. Margaret and Charlie loved it. Margaret went out and made t-shirts. So pick it up is the t-shirt day or the pickup day here at Acapulco. I talked to my friend Rudy who owns Tours by Rudy. If you ever need a ride somewhere, he's the man. Rudy knows a guy and he was able to set up for us um, escorts, police, the municipal police, the tourist police, as well as some workers to help us out. here at Playa Tlaco Panocha and we're here as part of Taking It to the Streets program sponsored by the Marine Life Studies in Monterey, California. Um, we, I think we've done a pretty good, good job cleaning up. The locals are taking interest and they all seem to appreciate what we're doing. There's even a reporter here, a local reporter that took all our names and he's writing up uh, a little article on his own. ¿Cómo te llamas? Francisco Camacho. Francisco Camacho, mucho gusto. I can't believe people from another country like states come to help us to clean our bay and Acapulco is too beautiful but too many basura, garbage is yeah. in here and, 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 we, and we don't keep clean as you can see but more in the ocean mm. under the water is more yeah. and this thing is too many years to disappear like more than 100 years do you throw away plastic on the yeah whatever but i can say thank you to you to come to clean to our country i anytime you welcome to our country mexico and acapulco it's an example for for a couple kenyans yeah to do something success so we're gonna walk down a bit, probably half a mile to Playa Manzanillo, see if they can, uh, if we can offer our help there as well. Say hello. Hey, Margarita. <laughs> Talk to you soon. Well, we've picked up quite a bit of plastic today, including those rings, the six-pack rings that the turtles seem to get caught in, straws, plastic forks, all of it's bad for the ecosystem. They thought uh, we were a little crazy doing what we were doing. You know, they were just staring at us for like five or ten minutes and then they kind of went back to what they were doing, enjoying it. And one, one gentleman actually thanked us, came over and uh, he couldn't believe, you know, foreign tourists would come in and help clean up Acapulco. It meant a lot to him. Margaret, what'd you give away? T-shirts. T-shirts? Nice people. Anything else? They loved it. Oh, grabbers. And they, they appreciated it. Oh, they loved it. They loved it very much. 
He doesn't have to bend over now to get yeah. his uh, <laughs> oysters or whatever he was going No, for. he was picking up garbage. Oh, was he? In they the water he was? Yeah, he took the tire out. He took a whole bunch of other garbage. I didn't know that. that. I thought they were fishermen. No. I did too. No. He was the gar basule, he said. Wow. So we gave him two? I gave grabbers? him three. Nice. Okay. So here in Playa Manzanillo, I don't know if you can hear it, but there's a lot of construction going on. This is where the a lot of ships or a lot of boats were stored. They're moving all, all those out. There's now a new, they call it a malecon here, where tourists can walk up and down now, just like over at the Socolo area. So there's a lot of chaos here. There's a lot of heavy equipment and a lot of workers trying to get the job done. This area of Playa Manzanillo is going to look super nice in the near future. Even our driver's picking up trash now. Well, the locals kept telling me to come to Playa Manzanilla for our cleanup, but you know, it looks to me they've got it under control. There's a whole public event going on. They've got heavy equipment, they've got representatives from the federal police, they've got school children here. Um, pretty much, pretty much everyone from Acapulco is here to help clean up Playa Manzanilla. I'd like to think that we inspired something here that, you know, seeing the gringos out cleaning the beaches uh, was the inspiration for all this activity, but no. They had it scheduled all along and it's been a long time coming, so I'm happy to see. Don't want to get my feet wet here. I'm happy to see that the taking it to the streets is already here in Acapulco. Thanks to everyone who's watched this video. And if you'd like to help out, please make sure to like the video and consider subscribing and click that little bell so you'll be notified when the next video is published. Many more videos to come. Thanks again for watching.